What's up guys, Sim here, and this is Street Race Talk, episode 38. I apologize, this is going up so late. I had a soccer game, and I just got back like 30 minutes ago. It is now 8 o'clock when I'm recording this. Normally I have the video up by 4, so yeah, sorry. But there's a lot of big news, and next week is the best week of the year. But we'll get into that a little bit, but because we have to get into the news. <clears throat> Birdman won the Amarillo no prep for $10,000. I mean, of course, Birdman wins everything. A Big, G Big Chief vs. Fro at No Mercy 7 on October 6th through 9th. That's like when the event is going on. I'm not sure the exact day they're racing. Uh, the Dirty South no prep. There's a lot of big names going to be there like Birdman, John Doe, Kai Kelly. They're all going to be there. That's going on today and tomorrow, September 9th and 10th. Uh, Booster GT was at Buffalo Valley, Tennessee, testing on the track. And Big Chief and Murder Nova will be on radials again at Darlington Dragway, October 1st. <clears throat> and Strange Engineering, they're, like, they teamed up with Shadow to put that amazing, like, beautiful uh, wrap on the car. And, yeah... I don't, I don't know what they're thinking with that. And also, I just saw this today. It looks like there's some beef between Disco Dean and David Bird Jones. So hopefully we're going to see a race between those two soon. Because those are two really fast racers. And really big name guys. Really fast. And I'm, I'll just be super excited to see a race like that go down. But now, time, so I kind of went through all that quickly. Because I want to get to the main topic. This is, like I said... Next week's the best week of the year. Could it cause it is hot rod drag week? This is like the thing that really got me into drag racing and stuff like that. I it was like 2012, I think it was. I first found out about it and I just loved it ever since. And Larry Larson, he's like one of my favorites. But to be honest, I want the guy from Sweden to win. The, he won the Stockholm Open last year, not this year. Some guy in a pro mod won it. But the year before, 1320 video had a whole thing about it. And they will be filming this whole event. And, yeah, I'm hoping he wins. I'm assuming he's going to be in unlimited, in unlimited class because his car is just insane. <clears throat> but Test and Tune is tomorrow the 10th, I believe. Oh, no. It is actually September 11th is registration and Test and Tune at National Trail Raceway. In Ohio. Then September 12th is day one racing. Still at National Trail Raceway. In Ohio. And then September 13th. Day two of racing. They go to Summit Motorsports Park. In Norwalk, Ohio. Then September 14th. Day three of racing. They go to US 131 Motorsports Park. In Martin, Michigan. Then September 15th. Day four of racing. Lucas Oil Raceway in Indianapolis, Indiana. I believe they were there actually on the, the fourth day of racing also last year. But I think that was when there was the rain and stuff like that. I actually had a whole video about Hot Rod Drag Week 2015. So you can go back and check that out. Uh, and then September 16th is the final day back at National Trail Raceway in Hebron. Hebron. Uh, I'm terrible with pounds and stuff. Ohio. And yeah. I'm super excited. I will definitely be talking about that most for most of the episode next week. It actually won't be over when I'm... Or no, I think you know, I'll wait to make the next episode until it's the drag racing is over. Because they do a bracket race after. But we'll know all the like guys competing will be done by probably sunset which i'm assuming is around seven o'clock so i'll try and upload it around same you know probably the same time this was a i didn't mean to have it this go up so late this week but next week i will so i can just talk about all the drag week and stuff like that and yeah that's about all i have to say there's not much news about drag week because you there's the list of guys showing up but you have no idea if those guys are actually going to show up or not because there was a bunch of guys last year didn't even show up because their cars were broke or something like that. And there's a bunch of guys that showed up on the first day and broke, like Jeff Lutz. Hopefully he does... Actually, I'm not sure if he's going this year in the Pro Mod. I have no idea. But what was that? Whatever. 
But I guarantee you Tom Bailey's going to be in his pro mod. I have no idea what car Larry Larson's going to be in. And like I said, the dude from Sweden, I can't think of... It's, I, I can't think of what it's called. His, like, the racing team or something like that. But he has, like, the Opal. That thing is going to be flying all week, guaranteed. So, yeah. That's all for this week. Thank you so much for listening slash watching. Tune in next Friday for Street Race Talk episode 39. And also follow me on social media. Links will be down in the description. And this is Sim ABC XYZ signing out.